I bet. Just a minute. It lives, I see. Do you want to speak with Lolita? I'm sorry, but Gabriel's allowed. I mean, he's out. You know, you could do better. I know I don't know you, but you could do better. Bye bye Good morning. You look like hell. Did you have another nightmare last night? Yes. Because having nightmares is what I do, apparently. Seventh damn night in a row. I told you, it's that voodoo book you're researching. That stuff can seriously Unfortunately, screw I don't think my readers would go for a horror novel about fluffy bunny rabbits. So voodoo it is. You mean your reader? She lives in Wisconsin, doesn't she? Bite me. Hey, what goes on in your bed stays in your bed as far as I'm concerned. I have messages for you when you want them. Gabriel doesn't need to carry that around. The chandelier is original. G all right, all right. He can't afford to replace it. The books on the table have been chosen for this. Those keychains were for a promo I tried one. I'm going to take the tweezers for a bit. Mind if I borrow the magnifying glass? No, Sherlock. Just bring it back when we get the next estate shipment. Not so lucky for the rabbit, was it? Images haunt the pages of Philip Knight's sketchbook, the way they must have haunted his mind. The my coat alone, Gabriel. It's no use. I can't sleep. All my clothes look the same, so why change them? Shut that refrigerator, please. Oh, I can smell it from here. Whim. Gabriel doesn't feel like reading, right? The typewriter is too heavy. Can. Writer's block. If Gabriel sat. If I threw those pages away, they weren't worth reading. At Giant Discount Bookstore, we discount every title 50%. When you see I don't need to, in fact. You'll never want to shop with those little guys again. Do you have men problems? Someone put a hex on you? Call Sister Cross. Through the power of love and the Lord Jesus Christ, she can fix what's ailing you. 
You're listening to KLEB in New Orleans, where we play the best music 24 hours a day. I want you to take hold of your prayer clothes. Better yet, take hold of your radio and let's do a miracle. But first, I want to talk about doing what's right. Those of you who are out there listening to these radio waves of comfort, you know what I'm talking about. Every day, this program reaches out into the darkness and pulls lost.